Hello, this is Seneca the Younger, and this is Andrew Hinderaker's Colossal. Andrew Hinderaker wanted to take several different perspectives at this massively popular American pastime, using several different angles, seeing how he loved football and growing up with it from the age of four or five down to the University of Wisconsin with its football games at Camp Randall. But he also looked at the super straight culture, one which is, to him at least, a little bit strange seeing how the players wear tights and block bodies for a living. Of course, this is his perspective. Thus enter our protagonist, Mike, or actually young Mike. There's two versions of Mike in this play, and I should preface with the fact that the younger Mike I will be referring to refers to Mike prior to his incident, and the older Mike is when he has had his incident. So, the younger Mike is busy playing on the field with his friends. His lover is Marcus, however, that becomes more complicated. In the beginning of the play, there's a scoreboard hanging above the field, counting down. Each quarter of this play is a new section of the play. Just like in a football game, how it's sectioned up into four quarters. Now. The most interesting element that drives forward the story is that structure, in my own opinion, which sets it aside from other plays. Still, it still follows the 12 steps of the hero's journey. With the beginning, it sets up the world, and it shows that in this world, everything is on the football field, almost everything that is, and a lot of it takes place in flashbacks and so on. So. Next is the call to adventure. This future is seen when younger Mike refuses the call to adventure at first. Now, now the reason why the call to adventure is rejected at first is because the is, uh, is because of the psychological function of the hero. He is the I. He needs to overcome a problem and he needs to sacrifice something. Now, this something will become his past. Younger Mike acts as the antagonist in this movie. Whereas Jerry acts as the mentor. Now we'll get to Jerry soon. In the beginning of the play, younger Mike is constantly taunting older Mike, telling him how he'll never be him, and so on. The audience gets to identify with this. Now we all get older, we all are not as good as we used to be, and so sometimes we like to reclude into our past. Now this gives lots of room to grow, it gives lots of room for action, as it is Mike, older Mike, who has to decide whether he will go into the future and whether he will act or whether he will give up. And that's where the sacrifice comes in. He has to sacrifice his past when he already was so good, when he set trends, when he set records, and he must replace that with the future, where he must set small personal goals, where he must go five feet rather than the whole mile. And so he has to deal with that death. He has to deal with the fact that he no longer is who he used to be. And that's how he's a fish out of water. His old world was football. His new world is walking. But we are not quite there yet. From the ordinary world, we see the call to adventure. And this is when the older Mike is requested to train harder, to be more like his older self. It's the question that beckons is Will Mike, older Mike, be able to eventually walk again? Will he take action and will he come out, sexually speaking at least, will he come out as being gay? The refusal of the call then arrives because he doesn't. He gives excuses to both his trainer, he gives excuses to other people for how he can't go on. He is very rejecting. And that's where his trainer comes in, Jerry, the mentor, who pushes it on. He not only physically trains him, but he also puts the therapist in physical therapist. Because he talks to Mike. So, then he starts to cross the threshold. What do I mean with this? He begins to commit to the journey. I would say this is when he overcomes his first great struggle, which is talking and telling Mike that he... Uh, which is telling Mike that he was attracted to one of his teammates. And so that is where his ally comes in, Jerry. His next ally, or his next test, is Damon, his father, who he has not yet come out to. And so, in Act 3, 
At the end, Damon is told by his son, Olmerg, that he used to like one of his teammates. Or at least he did said he said there was a teammate. We are not yet given this, because we then approach the innermost cave. We approach the fourth act, where he has to face his greatest fear, the moment when he lost his legs, when he became paralyzed. In the supreme ordeal, that is the epic battle when he realizes all of his memories in the past, all of the flashbacks that the audience has grown so used to, are not completely right. That it wasn't Marcus who held uh, Mike's hand, but instead it was the coach. That Marcus just won't be there for him in the end. And with that, old Mike accepts the death of younger Mike. And there he seizes the sword. That is where we see that his father accepts him. And that's where we see that younger Mike... That's where we see that older Mike is willing to go the nine miles. And he's willing to start the train. Working with his father on moving towards his stroller or his walker. And with that, the play ends. Personally, due to the topic and theme of the play, I am neither interested in... Personally, because of the topic and the themes of the play, I have to say that I was not the greatest fan. Though I was interested in the structure of the play it was very interesting to have it in four quarters this and the almost dense like movements of the players the actors was intriguing to me however my opinion on the piece because again i am not interested in either football or lgbt themes i have to admit that it was not exactly for me it is more designated for a niche audience i would say that this audience would be people who are into specifically LGB teams, because uh, people who are into football might not specifically agree with the uh, LGBTQ theme, so that is who I would recommend it to. Well, this has been Seneca the Younger, and this has been my review of Colossal.